Back center, shut outer doors, torpedo tube two. As a submarine, we're a hidden moving missile silo. The first time I saw one, you know, I was awestruck. I mean, they're awesome. I was up there driving a billion dollar warship. The sun was coming up over the marsh. It was just a great experience. We're the only ones who know exactly where we are, which makes it difficult for our adversaries to find us. Because the whole purpose of a submarine is its mission is to not be found. A normal day on a submarine while we're underway, we are in eight hour shifts. Most people have divisional duties and then usually people have eight hours of sleep time or video game time or time to just go work out. People think that life on the sub is very claustrophobic and it is definitely far from that. We have lots of space. The submarine is huge. Uh, people think you hit your head. I mean, I'm six foot tall and I don't hit my head on anything. Sleeping is fine. The food is delicious. It's always 70 degrees and fluorescent. You have your own bunk room, you have your own rack, you have your own rack pan, you have a drawer, you can fit plenty of stuff on it. You know, I was able to sneak a fishing pole into the outboards and go fishing while I was off duty. We'll watch a movie, some people play video games, everybody talks and hangs out. Everyone knows each other. You know your buddy's kids, you know their wives, their girlfriends, you know everyone. So everyone's so close to each other, so that's pretty, it's a tight community. You know, as communications wise, it's harder for a submarine to communicate with family. I get an email every week, maybe on a Saturday, and I'll reply to those emails. We were out for about 60 days or so at this point, and we did a steel beach. We surfaced out in the middle of the ocean, and I got the ability to go up into the sail and onto the bridge. You got to jump off the boat, jump in the water, swim around. After being underway for that amount of time and being able to do that just for a day, it really boosts people's happiness. Everyone is dependent on the next person. So everyone's trained in damage control, life-saving measures, because talking about 150 people, they're all dependent on one another to keep the boat afloat if need be. You get to know everybody, and you get to see all of those different styles of life, opinions, geographic locations. You get truly all of it on board, where you might not get that in another job. To this day, you know, for me, getting my dolphins, I mean, that's easily one of the highlights of my career. I mean, one of the things I'm most proud of. Pre-launch, tube two. Repeater attack center, pre-launch, repeater tube two. Another break, dog.